Piero. How have you been? I am doing well. How have you been, Intestines? I've also been doing well. Every time I see you, you are always in a rush. I have been quite busy with work. Well, now that I have you in front of me, may I ask you a question? Yes, go ahead. What do you think makes a good life? If there was such a thing as a happy life, my dear friend, it would appear to me that it is nothing but the simple things you can make sense of through your own senses and feelings. I say then that the state of equanimity is a happy life. To explain this, let me just say that people want and desire to acquire what they don't have and to pursue the things that they, will, that they think will make them happy. But I feel that there is no need to pursue anything with passion. And there is no reason to despair over these over things that people find terrible in life. To be happy, keep your mind on what is attainable and just be content with what you already have. Pay little attention to the things admired or envied and ravish these thoughts from your mind. You should consider the lives of those in distress and reflect upon their sufferings so that your you know your own position possessions and conditions may seem great and enviable to allow you to live more serenely and be and by ceasing to desire more you cease to suffer in your soul as the old saying goes i was upset about my lack of shoes until i met a man with no feet if you were to ask my pupil Tim and what I taught him about the happy life, he would ask you three questions. First, how are things by nature? Secondly, what attitudes should we adopt towards them? Thirdly, what will be the outcome of those who have such an attitude? Basically, th things are equally indifferent, unmeasurable, and arbitral. And for this a reason, neither our sensations nor our opinions tells us truths or falsehoods. Therefore, for this specific reason, we should not put our trust in them one bit, but should be unopinionated, uncommitted, and unwavering, saying concerning each individual things that it is no more is than it is not, and both is and is not, or neither is nor is not. Those who actually adopt this attitude will first be speechless and then find freedom from disturbance and hence thereafter pleasure. As I was answering your question, I felt as though you were not agreeing with me. Hey, Antestines, your friend is running towards you. Yes, Pyro, you are correct. That is my friend. So tell me, what, what do you think makes a good life? Well, I hear what you have to say, Pyro, but our ideas are quite different. I believe that a good life can be obtained through a quest of finding a simple life away from society. People should find a way to get out of the city life and back into nature. Once in nature, a person that is attempting to find a good life should start to let go of things that tie him down. Things such as marriage, religion, and property tie him back down and back into society. A person can truly be happy if they find a way to only satisfy their natural needs through nature. That is, the needs that we are born with, not the needs that society makes us believe that we need. By pushing ourselves into nature, we are finding our independence away from government and society and we could begin listening to our natural needs. I myself have reached happiness through living a simple life. I under understand my needs and address them. I have been out on the streets preaching my ideas for many days now. I see the confusion in people's eyes as they listen to what I have to say. I believe that they want to feel my happiness but they are constantly told by society that my ways are wrong. I know that if I keep on preaching, they will slowly find the courage to free themselves from the chains that society has tied them down with. This, my friend, is what makes a good life. 
I see that we do not agree on what makes a good life, but we can still be friends. Before you leave, let me remind you of what makes a good life. One must free themselves of society and listen to one's needs. If we fail to do so, we fail to obtain a good life, full of happiness. Everyone could reach this good life, even you, Pyro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have to go now. Think about what I said. You know where to find me if you change your mind.